Christianity has, I think, for far too long categorized eternal life or Christ's kingdom as simply going to heaven someday when we die. And I think that's not something that scripture tells us. The picture that especially Paul gives us in the book of Philippians is that Christ king, is something that Christ's kingdom should bear weight on our everyday lives as we follow Christ. Let's read Philippians 3.17 to see what he has to say about that. He says, Join together in following my example, brothers and sisters. And just as you have us as a model, keep your eyes on those who live as we do. In other places, Paul says this, Imitate me as I imitate Christ. Follow me as I follow Christ. Copy me as I copy Christ. And invariably, when we do that, when we follow Paul's example, or if the Philippians follow Paul's example, invariably they would be also following Christ's example. And so this is what the Christian life can boil down to. It's a following after those who are more mature than us in Christ as they follow Christ, and that we learn to follow Christ from, from their example. It's this idea of what we would call discipleship, and that is what we need to be doing. So why do we live this way? He says this in Philippians 3.20, but our citizenship is in heaven, and we eagerly await a Savior from there, the Lord Jesus Christ. And so we are categorized as citizens of heaven, as if we are presently, currently living in heaven, even though we actually still live here on earth. It's what many scholars call the now and the not yet. Our real home is in the presence of Jesus, but we currently live here on this earth. And so we ought to live as if we are citizens of heaven. We have to remember what Jesus said in the Lord's Prayer. Your kingdom come, your will be done on earth as it is in heaven. So far too often we get ourselves far too focused on our lives here and now in this world when our primary focus should be on living as a citizen of Christ's kingdom. We do this because our great hope is that this life is not all that there is. That someday Christ will return and become king over everything that he has created. Uh, one of my favorite pastors and theologians, he says, uh, his name is Matt Chandler, he says this, what Paul wants us to do is to live as if the kingdom, as if the kingdom of heaven really is at hand, like Jesus said it was. As if in some sense it really was coming to bear in history in and through him. And so we do that by keeping our eyes focused and fixed on Jesus who has promised to return and we wait for his coming. And in the here and now, we live within this now of our earthly lives with the truth that there is a not yet that is true and that is coming and it's on its way. And because we are citizens of that not yet, we are citizens of heaven and we should live in that light. And so here are some questions to discuss with your community groups. Is do you tend to live day to day more focused on what it means to be a citizen of earth rather than a citizen of heaven? And then secondly, how often do you think about the beauty that the joy that being in heaven will one day will truly be?